Good morning. There is growing concern when it comes to a homeless camp in Southeast Austin. It has some in the community worried. Good morning, everyone. I'm Sally Hernandez. And I'm Tom Miller. This 10 community is developing in Mabel Davis District Park. This is right near State Highway 71. Cake Sands Dylan McKim was out there to see what the park looks like and joins us now with what you saw and what you learned. Yeah, that 10 community is forming right behind a skate park, a very popular skate park that's used every day. The people I spoke with who are upset say the homeless camp creates an unsafe environment for kids and adults who visit the park. Mabel Davis District Park has gone through major upgrades in the past three decades. I know it and y'all always take care of it. That's why I appreciate it. Sonny Thomas grew up in this neighborhood and saw this park change for the good. I watched this park transform from an old dump that had that was completely wooded, that had DDT and all sorts of poisonous contaminants in the water, and they completely cleaned it up. He's proud of this park and still tries to come to it every day. But he says there's an issue growing behind this skate park. A tent community is popping up in this wooded area. Thomas said some of them had cut down trees to create paths. Some people I spoke with who walk these trails around the park every day say it's not a problem in their eyes, but Thomas sees it different. They're creating problems. They caught the woods on fire over here. We found a dead homeless person over here in the field just a month ago. Austin police said the death was not a homicide, but Thomas said no matter how it happened, it shouldn't be happening in a place meant to be enjoyed by the community. He wants the homeless people removed from the area. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, well, where do you put them? I don't have an answer for that. But right here, we have kids who come up here. I throw events here almost monthly, and I have seen the homeless people get in fights. KXAN reached out to the Austin Parks and Recreation Department. A spokesperson said the city and its partners have been conducting outreach in this area for several years and will continue to do so while social service professionals work to make resources available. Thomas said he would help fix the issue by organizing a community cleanup effort and planting more trees. There's so much potential here and when you allow things to keep people from coming here, like the homeless people, it really ruins my neighborhood and it kind of sucks. A city ordinance passed in 2021 says you are not allowed to camp in a public space that's not designated for camping. I did ask the city to specify what outreach efforts it was making and whether people are allowed to stay there. We will update the update this story when we learn more. Dylan McKim, KXAN News.